Hello, I am Brandon Plattner, and I am a faculty member here in the Department of Diagnostic Medicine and Pathobiology at Kansas State University. Welcome to the Histology and Immunohistochemistry Laboratory section here at the Kansas State Veterinary Diagnostic Laboratory. I am one of the board certified anatomic pathologists here at the lab, and I currently serve as section head and oversee the histopathology and immunohistochemistry laboratory. So the word histopathology has its origins in ancient Greek and literally means the study of suffering in the tissues. And so this is a cornerstone of the veterinary diagnostic process and the work here at KSVDL. Histopathology is the microscopic examination of tissues and lesions, and this has important and significant applications in clinical veterinary medicine. We study diseases in tissues from both post-mortem or necropsy samples where tissues are collected from deceased animals and in biopsy samples where those tissues are collected from living animals. So it is no small task to process and prepare those tissues and those samples from our patients to glass slides so that our pathologists can examine and study those tissues and those lesions in order to reach a definitive diagnosis for the benefit of our patients. In our section, we process samples from approximately 12 to 1400 necropsy cases per year and between seven and 10,000 biopsy cases per year. Our diagnostic work is in addition to the work that we do for researchers, both within and outside the K-State campus, various state and federal or private and regulatory laboratories. We are quite an active and busy section and we employ five full-time laboratory technicians, at least two part-time technicians and several student workers throughout the course of each year. So with that, I will now turn this over to and introduce you to Jennifer Finney, who is our laboratory administrator, and she will show you a bit more around the lab and some of the way that we contribute here to the work of KSVDL. Welcome to the Histopathology and Immunohistochemistry Lab here at KSVDL. My name is Jennifer Finney, and I am the Histology Laboratory Administrator. The Histology Lab processes formalin-fixed tissues and prepares tens of thousands of glass slides annually for microscopic examination for diagnostic, teaching, and research purposes. We work closely with the board-certified clinical and anatomic pathologists, as well as numerous pathology residents in training. Our routine and most commonly used stain is the hematoxylin and eosin, or H&E. The H&E stain demonstrates tissue structure and cell distribution and is used to evaluate lesions in a wide variety of tissues of any species. Immunohistochemistry, or IHC, is another critically important tool used by our pathologists in the diagnostic process. IHC allows us to use unique and specific antigen-antibody interactions to demonstrate those specific antigens within tissues, which we detect under a microscope using a chromogenic reaction or a color change. This allows us to diagnose infectious diseases by identifying bacteria or viral antigens within diseased tissues or to more fully characterize cancer cells or neoplastic diseases, which has significant impact on how those diseases will be treated by clinical veterinarians. We offer over 60 different and specific cellular markers and pathogenic organisms by IHC, and we work with the pathologists and other scientists or researchers to develop additional markers or stains helpful in diagnostic or research applications. Within the IHC laboratory, we also have a prion section where we analyze thousands of samples from sheep, goat, and cervids like deer and elk by IHC for scrapie and chronic wasting disease. We are accredited by and work closely with our colleagues from the state and federal agencies, including the United States Department of Agriculture and provide surveillance testing for the state of Kansas during the deer hunting season. We also have a digital pathology section which can scan at high magnification and resolution slides for use on our online platform, which allow remote access and diagnosis by pathologists here at KSVDL and outside laboratories for researchers and for use in teaching veterinary students within the DVM curriculum here at KSU. We are delighted you took the time to learn about histology and immunohistochemistry and its role in veterinary medical diagnostics, research, and teaching here at KSVDL, and we hope to work with you in the future.